The autonomous Kurdish region in northern Iraq is an area of stunning geography, but life in the rural areas can be harsh at times of drought. Many faraway villages still depend on thousand-year-old underground water tunnels called kares. Kares systems are tunnels that infiltrate the groundwater and lead it to the surface through gravity. The tunnels are intersected by air shafts to provide air. The ancient technology is the most sustainable way to bring water to dry desert areas. Professor Dale Lightfoot is a geographer from Oklahoma State University and a worldwide expert on ancient infiltration galleries in the Middle East. In the summer of 2009, UNESCO hired him to direct a survey of these ancient water tunnels in Iraqi Kurdistan. He found more than 650 karazes dotted throughout the region. 113 of them are still in active use. What he also found was a stunning amount of drying up karazes. Uh, we're here in uh, Piskandi village, a small village at the base of the Pira Magrun range, just north of uh, Slemania. Uh, there were six families living here um, as late as uh, late 2008, early 2009. Um, and the, both the Kurez died in early 2009. Well, one completely died, barely seeping, it's unusable. Uh, the other one it ceased use as ablution water in 2009 for the men's mosque and now uh, is used only for drinking. It's really unsuitable for drinking. There's so little water seeping out, but it's their only source of drinking water, so they continue using it. It is communally owned and operated. The village collectively uh, um, collects a little bit of money from each house anytime they need some repairs, and they have indicated uh, willingness to donate labor and whatever time they can to try to repair this Kerez. Uh, they just don't have the tools and they don't have the, the knowledge for, for how to make their Kerez work again. And, uh, they have some kind of very vague plans about sinking a well or something. They're just basically desperate for water, which is why they're, you know, hauling in water via tractor um, now, just so that they can stay a little while longer until they seek a solution. They just really don't know where to turn. Hopefully this water will allow them to hang on a little longer. This is uh, Piskandi Naude Karez. This was their principal Karez. This was also the Karez you know, used for the men's mosque. Uh, this is the only one that's still flowing at all in such a way that it can be used. Yeah, th I mean, it's, yes, it's a sad story. This is all they have. This little bit dripping out of the pipe is all they have left for drinking water.
We're here at um, Casa Caraba, which is a very typical village in this region between Erbil and and Slomania. This is a this is a very good example. Actually, they have two carres here. They have uh, Salhaga and Kanimalan. This is the Salhaga carres. It's about 900 meters long, about 30 wells, and like others in this area, have died just recently since the onset of drought. <laughs> This Carrez is about 900 meters long, has 30 wells, so it extends, you can see the first well off in the distance, the light coming from the ceiling of the Carrez. Another 29 wells continue off in that direction for almost another kilometer. Yes, it's dried up recently as most of the Karez, roughly 40% of the Karez in Iraq have dried since uh, 2005, the onset of drought. Um, and in many cases, uh, the Karez was the only source of water. And there are, there are a number of villages, probably, I'm guessing, somewhere around two and a half, three dozen, that have, this, have a similar story where out-migration is already underway and death of the village is not too far off in the future. Um, if someone doesn't intervene and, and clean the Karez and find some water for these folks. Sad story. And it's repeated several times around here. The drought is very real and is affecting these people's lives. ساعبي نما كود العزاغة عزاغة نما أم شورش بسرهاد شورش بسرهاد عالم إنفا أم إنفاز بسرهاد الفاكرة وبسرة روي كاز بزيمة فاج أوش قهاتي نوا أو أود هاد كاز قبر بو بيز بو بو إما تاقت ما نبو خايبين كي نوا جوليها أو هلانا زرع جاء السؤال سيم لبرك لذكي شيء بلي لبرك رابي برنج لبرك أو آوا لبزوري شناي لبرك را كنجي لبرك را تماتي لبرك را بامي لبيشك را أنواع شيء أوان لبيشك را أو آوا كنا ما هو صفر آوا أو كازه تعسيل إيمك أو كازه كنا ما تعسيل إيمك أو كازه هبوا إيمك تنكر ما بوسبه إذا كان إذا كان ما بتنكر أو ما بودي تنكر كش والله نمر نجية بس بوخوان حيوانات شمال أو تبيل دراوة زل أو خاصيزم أو ناخواته أو أجا باران ببارد أو هبيد ببارد دغلي بركة دغلي كروسي صار النية باران يوشوا.